TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome to your 1 p.m. update. I'm Steve Rhodes coming to you live from sunny Delray Beach, Florida. Right now, we've got the Dow off about 58 points, 27,018. S&P's down two, NASDAQ 100 up one point. So basically flat markets out here. Russell is the, uh, well, the transports are the leader on the way down, down about 90 points. The uh, Russell is off a half of a percent out there. Spot volatility index <clears throat> is up 1%, 14 cents, no big deal. Uh, there, uh, you've got uh, gold up two bucks, silver two pennies. No, seven cents out there. Light sweet crude is off 278. Oh, we need a chart. That would be helpful in the uh, update out here. So let me get that uh, going for you. Sorry about that, uh, Denners. Let's get that out here. And uh, so there we go. So now we've got the uh, charts out here. So um, let's take a look at. So basically today. Um, I don't know if you caught the show, not that you had to, but did Larry's show did the update at 9 and at 10, and it feels like we're just watching paint dry, because I don't think the markets have really done much uh, since uh, that last 10 o'clock update. Uh, here's what you'll watch during the day, and we were doing the same thing at 9 o'clock, price bounced off of it, and that is uh, on a short-term basis, just looking at short-term right now, uh, what the uh, Dow Equity Futures contract is doing is trading down into its support level of 27,008. It's a closing basis that is critical there. And what we saw uh, the e, uh, we saw the Dow Equity Futures contract is test that level for a couple of hours. It was doing that from uh, 9 o'clock, did it again at 9.30, did it again at 10 o'clock, and did it once more at 10.30, and then bounced out of there. No big bounce, nothing big. A big bounce would get you up over 27.255. That's 225 points from where we're at right now. Uh, that's not likely to happen. If you did see a close on a 30-minute base blow, 27008. What we ought to see is a run down to 26893. And really, it's the Dow Equity Futures contract that is the one that is providing you with the most amount of information right now. For example, the ES Mini was not testing support. So the ES Mini is stronger than the Dow. The support level on a short term base for the ES Mini is 2989.50. With regard to uh, silver, silver has an interesting pattern. If we take a look at it right now, um, it had broken through resistance. And if the high from uh, between 1230 and 1 gets taken out, uh, it'll move up into the 1815, 1826 level. Hey, folks, have a great day. Stay tuned for Steve Rhodes. That's me, the Trader's Edge, coming up next.